All righty, well, I'm back. Uh, yeah, I, I was talking about, uh, you know, how, how the federal government and the local government are handling over the American people, the most vulnerable, to corporate America to prey on them. You know, a perfect example, uh, guys, uh, you know, the, the federal uh, communication commissioner. I have filed many complaints. You see, the, 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 the violation of our constitutional rights are, are, are not limited to, you know, just uh, one thing. They are, it's crimes. It's, 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 a, it's a high crimes they committed against the American people, you see. And it's not because of terrorists or non-terrorists or what have you. It is a committed against everybody, against the American citizen. The, 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 after Patriot Act 1 and 2, during the clown bush, all right? They are they strip the American people. They have that civilian. They can they can go and listen and and spy in any of us. And this is unconstitutional, guys. Come on, read the Constitution of the United States of America. Google it. All right. They have they they, they got every uh, phone company. Okay, AT and T, Verizon, Sprint, uh, T-Mobile. Every one of those. Whether it's a home a landline or, or, or a cell, okay? Whether you have a computer or, or what have you. Microsoft, the only one that I really trust right now is Google. And is they are fighting the government, okay? The only one. But the rest are all sell out. And they all handed, they handed you know, our freedom to the federal government and to the, the, the local and, uh, and uh, you know, uh, law enforcement it's unbelievable unbelievable guys and they justify it they did that like they did the Pearl Harbor they did 9-11 so they can strip people of, of their and commit crimes against them you know because they knew that this country is based on freedom and and uh, and uh, liberty and pursuit of happiness to everybody and we all immigrants there is no, there is no such uh, illegal aliens. We all, we all here. We all come from somewhere. The difference between me and you punks that you got, it came 200 years ago. I came 40 years ago or 30 years ago. This is the only difference. And if we're gonna talk about the legal, illegal aliens, Mexicans, this is their land. Come on, stop, stop treating people like, you know, that, that's what they're doing in South Africa. That's what they're doing in, in uh, Palestine. That's what they're doing everywhere. You're annexing land and taking it from the original owners, and, and, and like they did in Africa and everywhere, Asia and everywhere. The colonies, you know, the British. And then there's no different here. So it, it stop, it stop jacking. It stop jacking and doing all of this. This is not, this is crimes, guys. This is crimes that you're committing against the American people, against all kind of people from everywhere. It's international crimes. You see, let, let, me, let me just inform you here. United States of America or the social services or, or the state or the county. You see, the refugees in Lebanon or in Syria or anywhere in the globe, okay, if they enter any land and they are in a, in, in a, in a government territory, all right, and they are refugees, that government has the obligation to give them security, food, shelter, and medical care this is not a gift now let's let's look close here you guys are denying the american people all this there is no security there are people hungry in the streets well there is food there is food everywhere I, i'll take that back i'm sorry there is food we get fat here if you are homeless or not we get fat guys there is food especially in california i don't know about the rest of the country Okay, but there is food here. Everybody wants to feed you. Oh well, they wanted to give you, or the, you know, uh, give me this and give me that because people lie and this and that. And you know, this food is gonna be thrown in the ocean. You see? Come on. So we're talking about security, food, shelter, shelter, not homeless, shelter. Whether a tent. Whether a, a, a house, an apartment, a shelter. 
this is government obligation to any recipients that they were legal or legal or you guys come on man you doing it for pets homeless find them a home what a what a hypocrisy what a bullshit bullshit man come on oh wow look at it. because you know why because you're getting money you're getting money you took my rummy <laughs> And you, you know, you you just keep kidnapping the dog, so I can go and release him from the vet and pay 159, 200 dollars, 250 dollars. Oh, you love your dog? Is he a family? You gotta pay to have him. Come on, stop jacking. Stop jacking. We weren't born yesterday. We're not that dumb. We might look like it, but we are not. Okay. So this is what I'm talking about. The AT and T. They are, it's a, it's a federal supported program, it's a lifeline. They try to gouge me, and I'm one of millions, okay? One of millions that this is done by all the, the telecommunication companies, okay? So let, let's just, let's start knowing who is doing what. Thank you.